through at 6 tonight fired Florida data scientist Rebecca Jones, claiming the state's numbers are not telling the whole story. So she launched her own coronavirus dashboard. Tonight, Jones claims that Florida has more positive COVID-19 cases than the Department of Health is reporting. Aid on your side, investigative reporter Masa Saidi is live in her Tampa newsroom tonight. She joins us now. So what are we supposed to make of these coronavirus contradictions, the state versus her report? So, Keith, Jones claims that the state is manipulating the information to try to speed up the reopening, but the governor has fiercely denied that. Essentially, he says she's just a troublemaker with a troubled past. And they're lying about the number of people tested. They are flat out lying. Fire data scientist Rebecca Jones has launched her own coronavirus dashboard. At first glance, her site looks a lot like the Florida Department of Health's. And no wonder. Until a few weeks ago, Jones was the one who helped create and update the state's site. But while the state is currently reporting approximately 77,000 cases, Jones claims more than 85,000 people have tested positive for COVID-19 in Florida. If you got a confirmed positive lab result, whether it is an antibody test or a molecular test, I, I'm putting you in there. Um, I think that the way they're choosing to use the numbers is misleading. Another example, the number of deaths. Jones says she included the nearly 100 victims who did not have a legal Florida address. Her goal is to give Floridians a clear snapshot of the virus's toll. It is literally only their data. All I've done is pull it, scrape it, put it into a format that people can process easily. Tonight, we're waiting to hear back from the Florida Department of Health and the governor's office. But the governor has criticized Jones in the past. She is not. The, the chief architect of our web portal. Last month, Governor Ron DeSantis said Jones wasn't even a data scientist. Essentially, he said she was an insubordinate, underqualified troublemaker. She was putting data on the portal, which the scientists didn't believe was valid data. That I'm not a data scientist or a the architect, well, I mean, I kind of just built the whole site again in like a day. So I think that speaks for itself. And as soon as we hear back from the governor, we will be sure to bring you his response. And you can check out Jones's dashboard and the state's dashboard on our website. And you can look at the numbers and you can decide for yourself. Keith. All right. Moss Society live in our Tampa newsroom. Thank you. If you have something you want Massa to investigate, you can call the 8 on your side helpline at 1-800-338-0808.